Welcome back, I'm Jay. We got Steve behind the camera. This is the Heads Up Show. Thank you so much for joining today. We are doing a Pittsburgh Steelers customer build. Steve, who's this for? I'm gonna say Zackle. I Zackle. hope that that's right. That's a cool name. I think Zackle watches the show. I think so too, because the stuff he got is definitely not ordinary. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta know. And we're doing some things here that are gonna be unique to this one. I we were just talking, Steve, before we hit record. I think this is the first time we've done a build where we're putting the Douglas Easy Pro Snaps on both the top and the bottom in conversion in this kind of manner. This helmet uh, comes, this, is, this has kind of probably been in our inventory a little while because we've got the old ratchet straps on here. All of the newer Speedflex helmets are coming with the updated cam lock chin strap. We're gonna be taking this guy off. He ordered Douglas Easy Pro Snaps for both the top and the bottom, plus a Sports Star uh, Speedflex converter. So we're gonna convert all of that, and we happen to have one of these guys, just a soft cup chin strap. So we're gonna put all this stuff on this one, Zach. If you have a chin strap at home that you wanna use, just pay attention, and you can do it. Do all this to that one. Uh, basically, you would just have to switch out the buckles. So here we go. We got some Douglas Easy Pro Snaps. We're gonna get this guy going first to make sure it looks legit and then we got to go to the helmet and we got to do all of the upgrades on the helmet to allow these things to snap on properly and if you not you zackle but anybody else out there is looking to pick up a collectible helmet i don't personally do this with all of them but we have our helmet ninjas that put all these helmets together and when we have extra 3d bumpers sometimes we'll just throw them on there um, when we can but you too can get a helmet just like this we're pretty damn close yeah all but, these parts will be in the video description and if you wanted to put a white or maybe a yellow face mask on your Steelers helmet you can do that mm-hmm I would do. You do whatever you want. Maybe it's one. They'll put a green one on here. That'd, <laughs> what? that'd look good, right? So he's switching the face mask from an SF2BD to an SF2BDC. Steve, what's that C stand for? Do you remember? It's for closed eye. So exactly. A little bit less field of vision. So the SF2BD or all the 2BD style face masks are kind of the all around mask, the utility mask. They kind of work in just almost any position could wear that. Um, the 2BDC, however, which is, has this closed eye, so it's a little bit more narrow right in here, it's really kind of designed more for you, or you have more uh, linemen or non-skill position players wearing it. Yeah, even running backs, yeah, I guess sometimes. we've seen wear them, but it, it does limit your field of vision. I, I don't know if I've ever seen a quarterback wear one. So we've got Under Armour unbranded clips. These, again, are the exact same ones the Steelers use. Get these in here. We have a, the new Shock Zero G visor. This one is Smoke 40, so it's tinted. If you're new to this show, hi, welcome. Thanks for finding us. <laughs> if you like football helmets, field use, or collectibles, we're the show for you. And if you're not happy with what comes out of the box and you want to upgrade your stuff, Go poke around greengridiron.com. Yeah, so we sell a lot of field use helmets for players, uh, youth level, high school, semi-pro mostly. We ship a lot of stuff outside the U.S., so we get a lot of questions. Hey, do you ship to this country? Do you ship to that country? Most of the time, the answer is going to be yes. So now we need to yeah, switch out the, the chin strap. So this is actually a little bit more complicated than normal, but still pretty easy. So we need to remove the strap lock completely. Get rid of the chin strap here. And we're gonna use the, there's already a T-nut in there. The Douglas Easy Pro Snaps, they come with T-nuts, but it's the same exact one that's in the helmet already. And we're just gonna put this guy on, tighten it down. Same thing on the other side.
and we're going to use this quick release tool to loosen the thumb screws on the back of the cam locks. Take these off. And then we need to convert these guys. These are the Sports Star Speedflex converters. In our last video, we did the, kind of the same thing here for the Nebraska helmet that we built. It, these collectible helmets, Steve, I can't tell the difference between these ones and the ones that the players are wearing on the field because we sell a lot of the, the field use helmets, like I said before, and these look like the real thing. I would not recommend playing in them. Yep, inflatable pads that liner inside and they are we think they're exact legit for sure yeah All right, Steve, the conversions are now complete. Uh -huh. We can put the chin strap on now. Jay's favorite part. Because it just, it's so easy. Boom. Next up, Steve, these awesome 3D bumpers. We deal with them all the time and we always say, it just gives it a really nice, classy, finished look. It's the cherry on top. Put this guy in the back here. I think the one in the back really kind of makes it more. We gotta, we gotta talk to the Steelers again. The Steelers with that gloss black. Oh, yeah. It's so nice. And somebody just asked me the other day, why do they have the logo only on one side of the helmet? Why is it, Steve? Tell us. I, I have no freaking clue. You know, here's the downside to the this awesome super gloss finish. Fingerprints. Super fingerprinty. Dust. So get used to it. <laughs> wow. That is intense looking helmet. Though. I am not going to put this one on my head because this one is going yeah. to someone. Someone else can have that honor. And that's it. We're done. Wow. Very, very cool looking. Yeah. So upgrades with the 3D bumpers, the Shock Zero G, Smoke 40 visor, and SF 2BDC face mags, Under Armour clips, Douglas Easy Pro Snaps, my favorite. That's this it. thing is fantastic. Thank you again, Zackel, yep. for this purchase. You're going to have it in a couple of days. And send us some pics. Seriously, we want to see what this thing looks like, and it's forever home. Yes, let us know what you think of this. Would you have done all of these? And if there is anything else that you want to see, just complain about it in the comment section. Yeah, you're going <laughs> to anyway. So like, subscribe, click the notification bell for more videos like this. Until next time, cheers. Cheers.